will be watching her for the next 24 hours. Uh, I'll be meeting with them tomorrow evening, and I will keep you updated. You will know as soon as I know. Correct, sir. Of course. Bradshaw, we have a problem. Something needs my immediate attention. I'll call you back. What is it, Veronica? Another civilian has accessed our encrypted internet network. That's impossible. No one can access the internet but government officials with high security clearance. Not quite. It appears that this person has found a way to access our satellites by independently bypassing our encryption. Where? The numbers seem to be concentrated in one area. That's Atlanta, Georgia. This is not good. That means it's spreading. This needs to be dealt with immediately. This is not your typical hack. This is going to take some time. No. You don't understand. The most valuable asset in the world right now is data. It's worth even more than oil. Internet corporations were getting too big, and sensitive data was being sold to foreign countries and used against us. So much so that they rigged our elections, manipulated our citizens, and spread propaganda. The internet has ruined the moral fiber of our country, and this is the reason why we shut it down. Internet addiction is what caused the great riots of 2025. If civilians get access to the internet again, We'll be on the verge of another civil war. So what do you suggest we do? The situation needs to be eradicated. And the players exterminated. Exigent circumstance. Correct. But I'll handle it expeditiously. But use an independent contractor. I want this to happen under the radar. I know just who to call. Veronica, the information you just shared with me does not go beyond us. Are we clear? We're clear. Good. Get it done. I'm on it. Hello, Bradshaw? Yes, Veronica. I have good news and I have bad news. Give me the good news first. Well, the good news, one of the players is taken care of. And the bad news? The other one got away. Veronica, you told me you were going to handle this. You gave me your word. I'm catching a flight to Atlanta immediately, and you can brief me when I get there. All right, talk to you soon. Bye. Bradshaw, welcome to Atlanta. So glad you could make it. I would like to ask, who is this that you brought with you today? This is my assistant, Beth. Well, hello, Beth. Nice I didn't to meet know you. we were involving other parties. You're not the one who makes that decision now, are you? You're absolutely right. I just asked you to come by here so that I could brief you on what transpired with the suspects in question. You mean your screw-up? Well, it wasn't exactly a screw-up. I mean, I did eliminate one of the suspects. <laughs> Calm down, I've got this. Don't cut you a politician. You can't be touched. I see you used your illegal internet to find me. That's another reason we had to take it away. Too much access. Mm -hmm. You killed my brother, then you tried to kill me. Obviously, you don't know who the fuck you fucking with. Back the fuck up. If you were gonna shoot somebody, you would have done it by now. You know what your problem is. You didn't use the internet. You let the internet use you. 
You fell right into my trap. <laughs> no, motherfucker. I am the trap. It's called supply and demand. You can't keep it from us forever. We'll burn this bitch down. By we, you mean your partner Darkseid, right? Who do you think gave you up? He works for me. What? Nothing personal. Just business. All nuts, no glory. <laughs> Life is like a game of chess. You use your pawns and your queens to take out the king. 